simplicity and beauty. Buena Vista, where tranquility is paradise and leisure is adventure. To reach the town, one should take the 15 to 20 minute ride with a pump boat from the Parola Wharf in Iloilo City. MacArthur Wharf is upgraded to cater the growing visitors each year. Locals would welcome you with the rhythmic dances. Should you want to go alone or with special people around you, locals would be happy to take you around and be able to interact with the culture and custom. It has its own and new Coast Guard station to keep track of vessels at sea. The countryside is home to the natives and the locals. And if you're lucky enough, they'd be happy to take with you a selfie. Buena Vista is home to more or less 50,000 people. Fishing is live, and so is trade and education. Being the oldest municipality in the island and province of Guimaraes, it is the center of higher education and the highest literacy rate in the entire province. Come, visit, explore, and experience the history that blends the culture of Buena Vista Hanon. Established in 1775 during the Spanish colonial period, stories say a Spanish governor general was impressed by the island, thus naming it Benavista, the Spanish for beautiful view. That is why each year, thousands of tourists enjoy the island adventure. Roads lead to the heart of the town, where local products can be bought at a cheaper price. Souvenirs, tokens and something sweet and delightful to the taste buds. While most tourists enjoy shopping around and exploring the satisfaction of their appetite, the bigger surprise lies on the shores. White sand beaches line the coasts of the town. Plunging into the water is a must for those who would love to see the world in this part of the archipelago. A few minutes away from the ferry terminal is the Abilardos Beach Resort in East Valencia. The sunset and the privacy is a perfect combination for those who would love to experience solace. In a neighboring area is the Quilapa Gading Beach Resort in East Valencia. Should you need conference venues and wedding avenues, Quilapa should be considered on your list. 45 minutes away from the wharf on board a pump boat is the Roca Encantada. Roca Encantada, or the Enchanted Rock, is a privately owned place by the Lopez clan. A summer house built on top of the hill serves as the main attraction to the place. Declared as a heritage house by the National Heritage Institute, the Roca Encantada are among the places where privacy is of utmost priority for the visitors. If you are a photography enthusiast, the Daksaan Echo Park is fit for sightseeing. For those who would love to have an affair with nature, the Echo Park is the perfect place for you. Another side of the island would tell you, forget about the white sand beaches and make a trek up the highlands for the La Ciesca Inland Resort. A pool to swim and rooms to stay for backpackers and travelers await you. Diaya Lake is a magical place within the center of a small barangay called Ambulo. Located at Barangay Salvacion Benavista, it's known to be the fishing area of fishing enthusiasts 
Brianda Lake is rich of tilapia. Are you wondering where yachts are made of? Or they call it galleons. The old folks from Barangay Rizal Benavista are the ones making these amazing products sold to the Balik Bayans and foreign tourists visiting this place. It's the oldest livelihood in this area that still exists until now and was passed from one generation to the other. Not Nestor Foods Are you wondering where do we bought the dried mangoes, mango puree, mango jams, and other products out the freshly mangoes? It is because of the brilliant ideas and unique inventions of a farmer scientist, Rebecca Tubumbanwa, based at Barangay San Isidro Benavista. There is a McNester, the best pasalobo in Benavista Libras! Some say wonders are found in the wild, but in Buena Vista, sometimes they are made. Take a stop of the RGL pottery creative design such as the pagoda would give you the countryside feel you will miss when you go back to the urban zone. The good thing is, you could always purchase one for souvenirs. Not far from the pottery house is the Neptune Pittman's Garden Resort. Now this is like traveling while communing with nature. Color strikes, exotic plants, and flowers adorn the place. And then there's a spa and conference hall for those who would love to bring more. Experience Benavista would not be complete without taking a stopover at the San Isidro Labrador Church in Navalas. Built in 1880, the century-old church was preserved, built from native coral stones. Understanding the locals and their devotion to Christianity, take a stroll to the Navalas Church. There's always something to look forward to every January. The Palayag Festival The Palayag Festival, held each year, is their way of thanking Senor Santonino for his smooth sailing, being the locals' primary source of livelihood. During this festival, the locals' sweetness, delicacy, and another source of livelihood is the production of the world's sweetest mangoes. The best way to enjoy it is by joining the Mango Eating Contest. You get to eat more and bring home extra cash. Where there is tranquility, there is beauty. Salida, Buena Vista.